Next, let's have another special products, and that is the square of binomial. The other special product are formed by squaring binomial. Like the quantity of x plus 4 square and the quantity of x minus 2 square are two examples of binomials that have been squared. Let's look at the first example. The quantity of x plus 4 squared in expanded form, it is x plus 4 times x plus 4 is equal to x squared plus 4x plus 4x plus 16. You can use the FOIL method and collect like terms. So the product of x plus 4 squared is equal to x squared plus 8x plus 16. Have you ever seen a pattern? Whenever we square a binomial like this, the same pattern always occurs. See the first term, which is x? In the final product, it is squared. And it appears in the middle term. What about the second term? The middle term is 2 times 4, and that is 8. And the last term is 4 squared, that is 16. That is the square of? binomial. So squaring binomial will always produce a trinomial whose first and last term are perfect squares and whose middle term is two times the numbers in the binomial. Or for two numbers a and b, a plus b square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square. For the first term, Multiply the first and the second term times 2, then square the last term. Is it the same pattern if we are subtracting as in the expression y minus 6 square? Let us see. The expanded form of y minus 6 square is equal to y minus 6 times y minus 6. And y times y is y squared using the FOIL method y times negative 6 is negative 6y negative 6 times y is negative 6y and negative 6 times negative 6 is positive 36 so it is equal to y squared minus 12y plus 36 it is almost the same the y is squared the 6 is squared, and the middle term is 2 times 6 times y. However, in this product, the middle term is subtracted. This is because we were subtracting in the original binomial. Therefore, our rule has only one small change when we subtract. So for any two numbers, a and b, the quantity of a minus b square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square. Doon lang sila nagkaiba. If we have difference of this, it means our middle term is negative. Let's have this example. Remember, a plus b square is equal to a square plus twice the product of the first and the second term, then square the last term. We have square the first term, x square, multiply the first and the second term times 2. 3 times x is 3x, times 2, that is 6x. Then square the last term, and that is equal to 9. In... Second example, we have z minus 4 squared in expanded form. That is z minus 4 and z minus 4. But remember, we have a pattern. Square the first term, z squared. Then, twice the product of a and b. So, our a or the first term is z times negative 4. That is negative 4z times 2. That is negative a z. 
Then square the last term. Negative 4 square is positive 16. The product of z minus 4 square is equal to z minus 8z plus 16. Okay, let us check your progress. So multiply the quantity of 2a plus 3 square. Again, square the first term. Twice the product of the first term and the second term, then square the last term. Is it A, 4A square minus 9? Is it B, 4A square plus 9? Is it C, 4A square plus 36A plus 9? Or is it D, 4A square plus 12A plus 9? Remember to eliminate uh, this A and B. Bakit? Because our product is a trinomial. O, hindi nakasama ang A at, at B sa pagtipilian. So, what will be the product of 2A plus 3 square? The product is letter D. 4A square plus 12A plus 9. Why? If we're going to square this, 2A square, that is 4A square. Multiply the first and the second term. 2A times 3 is 6A times 2. That is 12a. Then square the last term. That is 9. Another. Multiply 4a minus 3 square. Is it a, b, c, or d? The correct answer is c. 16a square minus 24a plus 9. Remember, if we have difference... The middle term is negative. Bakit yung naging negative? Because 4a times negative 3, that is negative 12, times 2, negative 24a. Okay, so I hope na intindihan nyo ang special product. If you have question, you can uh, chat, text, or call. At masaya ako na sasagutin ang mga tanong nyo. Uh, Mag-practice, magsagot, at Sundan lang ang mga pattern at mga natutunan sa lesson ng special products. So, thank you and stay blessed everyone. Bye!